everybody, and welcome to the Grim Report. As you can see, who this is about, Old Orpheum. Yeah, I got two pictures up here for you guys. <laughs> yeah, one here and here. And this is what does this bear look like? It's a drawing rendition. This is its gravesite. Now, who is this thing, or what is it? Well, you know, it's a bear. This is in Utah. Old Orpheum. This is a strange one, guys, even for me. It's a bear that's said to roam around even centuries after its death. Its name is Old Orpheum. And they said that he was a legendary giant grizzly bear. And he still roams the bear Lake Valley. To this day, so they say. And he has roamed it 92 years after his death. So the story goes, guys. He was known as Three Toes because he had deformity known as Sheep Herders. He roamed the Cascade Cat C A C H E National Forest in Idaho. Until he was killed in August 22nd, uh, 1923. He weighed about a thousand pounds. He stood about nine feet, eleven inches tall on his back legs. So this thing was huge. Story says that he killed 115 people around Long Logan's Canyon. But no one knows for sure. No one knows for sure if what he did. Guys, tell me, you guys know any more about this? But the, from what they said, he still roams as a ghost. Do you think that is true? I mean, I know old Orphan's tree. I mean, come on, seriously, guys. They don't bury a legend body. If it doesn't never existed. So yes, this thing does exist from what I know. Now let me enlarge this guys to let you know that yes, this is actually what I'm talking about. This thing. This is a gravesite of Old Orphan himself. Now, to my left, or right, is a picture of what he looked like. Now, I for one don't think they would bury something that never existed. So, I for one believe that this thing, he did exist. Now, if he roams the countryside to this day, there have been some sightings, yes, but I'm skeptical, very skeptical, but, you know, I believe in paranormal, I've seen things, uh, but I would not want to see 11 foot tall There. Don't know about y'all, but I wouldn't want to see a 11 foot tall bear. Now let's just put that there. And let everybody know, yes, I do mess around a little bit with the laptop, but not too much. Now, I would not want to see a ghost of this guy. Let alone this guy himself, even if he was alive today. In physical form. I would not want to do that. Because Grim, not scared, but I'm not going to stand there and see how tall there is, to be honest. Now, I'm not sure who killed him. I didn't go too far in depth into that. But I will tell you this. The research was kind of slow in coming.
They had a lot of pictures, but not a lot of information. Now you can look up the name right there. You can look it up. See if you if you want more information. You can even look up the tombstone right here, the headstone. You can look up, see where it's located at, and everything like that. But there wasn't a lot of information. Like I said, this is a short one. I do short ones. I'm recording this on the 31st, so I can have this out Monday. Saturday and Sunday. Sunday I go to church. Saturday I have a lot of uh, cleaning to do. So I'm doing this on the 31st, which is a third, which is a Friday. But this will be out Monday. That's why I'm doing it now. That's why I do pre-record. That way I can have this stuff out when you guys need it or want it. Or if you look at it, watch it, whatever, or don't, you know, that's up to you. But if you like the videos, you like what I do, even the goofy crap that I do, like and subscribe. Likes help me get more information out there. This information out there. Subscribe will I mean you get more information, you get my well, I don't know what else uh what what uh or what you would call me. Uh goofy, weird. I'm kind of all of them. But uh yeah, just letting you guys know that when I do come up with more information for something you know, if I do do website research and you guys want to know more, I'm going to try to put links in the description as soon as I can, you know, if I remember to do that. Not, you know, you're not out of luck. The name's always going to be up here or down in the description below. I'm going to make sure the name's vegetable so you can copy if you need to or type it out or whatever. I'm going to try to spell everything right and proper so you guys can get all the information you guys want. I know these are little tidbits, but hey, tidbits lead to bigger and better things. You got to start with a small block, small cornerstone, build that wall. <laughs> But let me know what you think about this in the comments, please do. And, uh, yes. With well, that said, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages. Good luck. And good night.